tomorrow, Victoria, we are to be. Mm. Mm-hmm. Oh. Married. Helena, thanks for talking to us. Thank you. Um, could I just start by asking you to tell us a bit about Emily? She is a corpse. She's dead. She's been dead for some time. She was killed on the eve of her um, wedding and uh, uh, has been sort of buried alive ever since with her hands stuck up waiting for someone to come marry her and free her from the state. And... Uh, uh, Victor, our hero, played by Johnny Depp, he's he's sort of rehearsing his wedding vows. He's married or betrothed to Victoria, and he finally gets it right. He's in the forest practicing and getting them right, and um, he slips the ring on this tree root, and it's actually Corpse Bride's wedding finger, so she comes to life. I am terribly sorry about what's happened to you, and I'd like to help, but I really need to get home. This is your home now. But I don't even know your name. Well, that's a great way to start a marriage. Shut up! Mm. It's Emily. Emily. Now, there's, um, you've voiced two big animations this year. There's obviously Corpse Bride and Wallace and Gromit. Yeah. Um, how did you find, how's the whole animation... Try that again. Animation? Yeah. Um, <laughs> how's, how is the whole recording of animation for you as, a, as an experience against regular filmmaking? It's fun. It's really fun because, you know, you just, they don't, um... It doesn't matter what you look like, you know. You can pile in at nine o'clock. You don't have to be there at six. You don't have to wait around for anything because so much of filmmaking is waiting, you know, for weather or camera or something, you know. And it's just you and the mic. Uh, and it's quite liberating. You just sort of, like, act away. You do have to act. You can't just phone it in. You can't read it. Um, and uh, so I actually learnt my lines and sort of acted it just as I would any other part, but they just used my voice, you know. With, obviously, Wallace and Gromit and Corpse Bride, stop-motion animation has really enjoyed a bit of a boom recently. Yeah. Um, I mean, what do you think is the appeal of it? What What is it that makes people take it to heart so much? I love... Um, I think it's... I think you can really tell. I think there's, there's a lot more soul to it, you know. You can tell that people have been... that they're three-dimensional, you know, and they actually exist, these puppets. And um, they're just moved, you know, incrementally and taken a photo and then just another millimetre move. And I think you can really relate to them. I think that it sort of goes straight to the part of one that used to play with your own toys when you were, well, my son's age, you know. And um, he's two and I can see that he looks at his toys and he thinks that, you know, they animate. You know, they're as alive as you or me, you know, in his head and in his imagination. And I think that's, that's part of it. You know, you can think that they're just toys come to life. Next to the graveyard by the old oak tree On a dark foggy night at a quarter to three She was ready to go, but where was he? And then she waited And then There the shadows Was it the man? And then The little heartbeat so loud And, and then And then, <laughs> baby Everything went black The puppets themselves, that, I mean, they're works of art have you, yeah, have you been are. fortunate to take an I have got one. Taken, I've got, got Corpse, yeah. Have I've you? got the bride. She's on the piano at home. And uh, that was kind of my going home present. Tim gave it to me. But we got lots of props. In fact, Tim kept a lot of the puppets. In fact, we got the whole lot of them at home. <laughs> Just, well, don't let your son play with those. I know, that's the thing. He's going like, oh, toy, toy. I'm going like, no, no, not toy. <laughs> Thousands worth of, you know. Yes, you know. inheritance. Yeah, so. that's your education, love. Yeah. Helena, thanks very much for your time. And thank, thank you very much you. for the film. Thank you. Thank you. Cheers. Cheers. Tim Burton's Corpse Bride. This is going to be good.